except that he's from France and part of this wonderful, wonderful French uh, community. They are really doing an amazing job, man. They have so many cool initiatives in French craft. They support craft a lot. Uh, there just seem to be great vibes among them. And we have our game. Fish? Yeah, Fish, man. He is... He's one of a kind. <laughs> I saw him play a little bit of... Uh, what was his name? Ah, uh, this one human streamer who was banging his head against the wall. Was kind of like a legend for a while, then got banned. Um, You know who I mean. Help me out. Mass Footman could definitely be a thing for Fish. He's a little bit wacky in his playstyle, but he's also recently very successful. And I don't mind seeing his games, they're always freaking entertaining. So, let's go. <laughs> okay, fish with an archmage, probably a lot of footmen. Or he adopted a little bit of a more normal play style. I haven't seen him in a bit. Also playing in the Dust League, if I'm not mistaken. So on the other side, we get a keeper. This is the norm on this map. Kind of interesting to see this map going through. Because it is slightly Night Elf favorite, I would think. Especially with a keeper on uh, mid-high level. A town is under siege. Le fish, indeed. <laughs> and this might be the first time I see a blast game. So good luck, mate. A player's forces are under attack. He defeated Sonic, so he seems to be in good shape today. Lightning shield looks good, looks real good. Oh, not anymore. Thanks to the second lightning shield, but he's not denying anything. Another keeper comes in to clean this up. Thank you soon, by the way, for going through the ban appeals and this madman fish is seriously going for an expansion against the keeper jesus thank you dumbledorko for the five month reserve keep up the good work neo pound thank you very much where are the orc icons where are orc icons Am I missing something? Is that gone now? I don't see anything. Maybe uh, we'll sit on the cache or something. So, fish expanding. Builds a bigger pond, if you want to say so. Likings Pro, exactly. That was the unit I was talking about. Um, but yeah, expansion coming. A player's forces are under and this delays the, t the uh, dispel for fish and then the keeper. Can put up quite some damage. Usually it's a rather tier 2 push-ish map for human. As the keeper is just so oppressive. With every entangle this should lead to a kill. There's the entangle. There's the focus fire. Don't think the focus fire is good enough yet. Even though there's no dispel. Oh, with treants this might lead to a deny. Not really. With another entangle. Doesn't get away with, oh. with murder here. That's the first kill. Saves the archer. Well done by Blast so far. He's not necessarily spamming out his mana. Now he is with the third entangle. Question is, can he get in range? Ooh, that was a high roll. <laughs> but probably gonna get some counter kills here. Uh, good play by Fish, though, as he's accomplishing two things at the same time. He is expanding without any pressure to his workers, or towers, or main buildings. Plus, he's keeping the keeper away from level 3. With some decent denies. Oh, not here. Not saying that this expansion is safe, or that Fish has already won the game or something. It's not that dramatic. But, you know, good game plan. Decent execution. Moving a lot of water elementals back, moving a lot of footmen back. Here comes the vault, so we can heal this back up and probably do this again. As we have another sub, the real Rashiel, 10 month. Here's your Twitch monies. Thank you very much for the primer. And... 
EFC MMZ with 111 bits. Party! Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, Blast needs level 3. He's not far away, but this creep spot is dangerous. We all know it. Still not offend by fish. And we have a second barracks, maybe. A player's no. Forces are under attack. Fairly standard so far. For an expansion play. And no punishment whatsoever from the Frenchie. But this will change. Now, hello, level 2. Items not the greatest on either side, right? Fish didn't even creep anything. Uh, don't know what item he got. Kind of missed that. So Naga second. Creep Jack by Blast. This is one of his biggest power spikes all game. Let's see if the Naga gets the last hit. He does. Ouch. That also denies level 3 Archmage. What a blunder. As he loses the item as well. Disastrous creep spot for Fishy. And even if he gets a couple of kills, it's archers. It doesn't really matter. Fish is losing more and more HP. Little lucko that there's not enough mana. But last, quite cool. He was charging up on tier 1. And that is the power of a level 3 keeper. Nothing else to say. Defense is finished now, finally. It's still going to reduce or result in two kills while... He's keeping the archer safe, getting a double kill, water elemental summoned, but this is just pure distraction. It's not that the expansion is super fortified or whatever. This is level the entire level one from this creep spot. Ooh. Yo, nasty. Um, Blast is expanding himself. So he knows he's gonna have some time. Apple skill burn 44 month, my man. Much love. Foggy wins. Damn, that was fast. Yeah, that's a one sided affair if I ever saw one. <laughs> There's so much mana left. Now in the shadow of the tower, but... Okay, Naga has no mana anymore. Uh, he's waiting for his expansion. He's waiting for his tier 2 buildings. So far, he's doing all this, all this dominance. With just two heroes and tier 1 units. Feels like he wants to finish this fast. No tier 2 for fish yet. Can he reach for another entangle? Doesn't seem so. But he lost the blacksmith and that is indeed delaying the rifles even further. Yep, tier 3 coming. Pliability, the field reporter himself subscribes for the third month. Yippee! What are you happy about? Tell us. We need more positivity. Ooh, we need more health fish with the block, but the staff is ready. Need more positivity in this world. What are you happy about? Tell us. How many footmen died this game? Footmen. Naga's at home, healing up. Couple of archers saved as well. Good saves. Oh, keeper though. Okay, time to breathe for fish. Is it called breathing for fish as well? Because... Oh! Ho, 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 blast! Foo, foo, foo. Imagine a creep jack here, but I guess he's in no position to do so. If you have something cool to share, do it! Mountain King second. Finally rifle casters. But we're around the 10 minute mark before the first rifle is out. Blast seems to be very comfortable with the keeper. Very, very comfortable. And that's just how Amazonia games look in Night Elf vs. Human if the human gives him some time and gives him level 3. But okay, the timings for fish are yet to come. 
double Rex rifles. He's gonna get stronger fast. But tier 3 is finished for Blast as well. Every Stormbolt should result in a kill. We don't have Marksmanship yet. No third hero yet. No Bear Tech yet. So there is some time for Blast, uh, for, for Fish to do some damage. And he's reducing the number of archers by quite a bit. This makes marksmanship less effective and in general lowers the damage. Ooh, threatens a focus fire here. Staff's on cooldown. Oh, forces a potion, but also this MK doesn't look too hot anymore. Forced into a potion himself. Has no mana anymore, but taking up the first right is a big deal. Because there's no dispel. Now there's no poison. And apparently these rifles are kind of doing it. Reveal now. More focus fire. Blast willing to go for... Ooh. For a dead MK. Oh no. That loses him the game. Transferred the TP. Didn't use the TP in time. Had nothing left on his Archmage and gets... Gets punished real hard. <laughs> Fish don't breathe. <laughs> yeah, I mean... Do you know what I mean? A player's forces are under attack. Is there a different world in the English language for it? That's the question. Blast so confident now. Ooh, he missed the adept upgrade. And apparently, Fish doesn't care about the double hero kill. Fish stays in this game. Builds more rifles. Got both heroes back. That was expensive. And tier 3 human could potentially dominate this army as Blast is not preparing for a mountain giant transition at all. Fish still has a shot in this. Especially with higher levels. I'm just gonna get a good damage boost with this. Sobi Mask for the Mountain King is amazing and he sent the Archmage away so full experience on this MK is getting him close to three. No, you madman, don't do the red. That would be suicide. One bear only, I think. Fish is getting there. There is a timing window though. That he has to hit. Because if there's mountain giants, it's gonna be real tough. He can, of course, just. Oh, he's going into knights already! Well, that expands his window by a lot. I think he would just go for inner fire rifle and try to finish the game, but the knight transition? I like it. Plus the levels. He's gonna get level 3 soon. Blast needs a very solid solution for this late game. Bears won't cut it. Mountain Giant's not upgraded. Third hero coming now. How many orbs does he have? Already on two. That was very expensive. So even though the army is looking too hot, the lumber isn't looking too hot either. Thank you, Alma Kakaka, for the two one sub. Much love. Good nickname. Man, that would be quite a thing. The fish wins this despite losing all his footmen early. And the two heroes early. Fish respire. A player's forces are under Damn, thanks. See, I thought there's a different word. I was right, again. Creep check now with a level five keeper. There is the spell, but a limited amount. 
Not too many priests yet. Fish at 66. Brave enough to go for this <coughs> red spot. Inner fire now. Who's gonna get the last hit? Oh, it's so close, but I think Fish got it. It was a big jump in experience, but item, the class plus 12, they go to blast. Could be a potential big fight. Clap comes in, inward potion. Need some healing though. There is Holy Light at level 3 now. At level 2 for the Paladin. This is Divine Shield. Breaks out of that! What a clap! Fish the madman! Foggy with the 2 0, so he's in the semi final. We'll meet the winner of this game. Level 3. Okay, Fish got this, right? If there's no Chimeras, how is he supposed to deal with this? Four knights, four rifles, couple of priests. Let's effing go! 30 supply lead. Okay, there's no Holy Light anymore. Wait a minute, this is Paladin dying! <sighs> Last second. Town is under siege. How do you get this Paladin out? There's two heal scrolls, but there's no staff. Pally gotta be careful. He's probably gonna die soon. With that Naga with Fork Lightning. I can only imagine there to be a nuke soon, but he's going for the Archmage, wants to hold this base, which is a smart move. He knows he can't fight, there's no... Oh, mana shield! <laughs> Wait! Then there's... Okay, two, level 2 fork lightning. Not bad, actually, if she's an orb carry anyway. Archmage, still too brave to go into the TP, divine shield. And that is finally the way out. Blast got what he wanted. Had to use a couple of wisps for repair. That cost resources. But he's still in this game. Cool game that we're into. And Fish is paying a lot of upkeep this game. Over a thousand already. Clearly over a thousand gold. But switching gears. We do have workshops now. We go frag shards. We go more upgrades. These knights are going to be 2-1. That worries me the most that there's only bears and is clap is strong huge. against bears. Oh, it's Singapore, not Philippines. Sorry. Well, next push. And once again, there's no item on this paladin and this time the paladin just melts. Blast, are you fighting your way back into this? Getting two kills right away. MK, of course, has a lot of mana. He's the weapon. But it's just hero focus at this point. Look at this damage. With the Holy Light gone, there might actually be a chance. But no mana on the Naga now. And Clap is just crazy good. Trading bears versus knights. That's level 5. But don't underestimate the orbs of Venom, guys. That's a lot of damage. Three of them. Entangle. Focus fire. Look at the melt! These heroes, Jesus. Gets level 4 now, takes two knights out before the TP. But now everything is low. And it's daytime. And there's almost no moon juice. How long can he withstand the AoE of frag shards and clap? And does he have enough dispel against slow? Last. Close the supply gap. And if you have no moon juice, then just heal up with uh, rejuvenation. Fairies coming into the mix. But this takes some time. Thank you, Dr. Sirius Raven, for the 19 month resub. Okay, 
Here's the next clap. Do we have heal scrolls? Not really. Would love to see some more heal scrolls. Now the pally is back. We go for the MK once more. <laughs> Good control by fish so far. Bears are finding their targets. One bear not in master form. That's a little unfortunate. But this time Blast can't get the hero kill. He's still at 80. But the question is for how long. Because Clap is about to change that. Needs to find a solution against this MK. He's trying to focus fire once again. No TP. And oh, the staff is there. Sick. But yeah, this is not much HP left. He gets the hero kill here. So everything is exposed. And we still have that strong fork lightning. Man, everything just dies. Fish at 60. Blast at 60. And both are gonna drop more and more. Naga with level 3. Increasing that nuke. Triple hero night elf against triple hero human. How amazing. How amazing. Blast is gonna cry now though. 30 supply gone. He was the first one to expand. Main gold mine empty. And now we're on one base. One base. Hero, focus, everybody. Quite sick. This game, by the way, is an example of why we don't move the hero boxes to the very top. Because there's quite some update upgrades. 10,000 gold. That's all that fish is going to get. What's up with the overlay? If you guys have some feedback, let me know. <sighs> Brave enough to push this without a single consumable. Well, the anti-magic, I guess. Good building placement here. Bears can't reach too easy. So he's going for the throw. Paladin is still not back. It's going to take a second. So many wisps. Level 553. Five, We're very close to tranquility. We do have a storm ball, or we should have a storm ball against this. Shop in the back of things. Fairy dragons as well in flare form. This fight is crazy. Long front row. Lots of mana on this Naga. This could possibly result in a lot of kills and tranquility. Cancelled. Very fast. Drain some more mana from this MK. Bears are falling in quick succession. Time for hero kills again, but not through this invo potion. The, no, 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 the keeper! Whoa, he turns the hero focus around. And without Entangle, how good is this hero focus still working? Bears trying to retreat. He needs to get kills on these knights and possibly on the hero as well. Frag shards, so brutal. And Blast is retreating. What a fun game. Both at 50. And we have mass teleport now, don't we? Looks like it. I think our overlay... Huh? Was oh, the Brilliance Aura 3? It is! Was the Mental 3 Brilliance Aura 3? And very, 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 very close to a level 5 MK. Almost as close as it gets. With Clap level 3, I don't see Blast take these trades anymore. And that's it. With the Sobi Mask. Look at this mana region! Level 3 Brilliance Aura plus the Sobi Mask. Madness. But the army still isn't strong. 51 supply by fish. We take a look at the upkeep once again. A player's forces are under attack. A town is under siege. That's a lot. <clears throat> So, Blast, can you just hold on until this map is mined out? <laughs> 
Tree of Eternity backup expo still there. Of course, staffs don't end up next to the Moonwells now or next to the shop. And this expo is in danger. Big, big, big danger. MK is ready for the clap. Is it damage enough, though? Water shards? Yep, it is. But this is just a little bit of a delay as the Tree of Eternity is already there. So it was a good call by Blast to move it over already. But I feel like this push is coming back in waves, guys. Once again, an anti-magic. But what to do against this level 5 MK? Isn't he just the sole savior of fish? So if this game goes any longer, Blast might have three channeling ultimates. <laughs> Feels bad, man. Where's Blast Gold going? Ah, he's only starting mining now. And he has to hold this. Fish at 50 has only knights. And a couple of mortars. There's almost no dispel. Wonder if Entangle is going to do a big difference once again. Ouch, Clap is so powerful. Clap is just so powerful at this level. Bears are gone. MK with an invul. Tranquility immediately stopped. Combo with the Clap and the anti-magic is just way too late. Paladin counter kill. But the bottom is falling as well. It's all on the Naga now. No way. Don't tell me. Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. level seven. Naga chasing, but it's GG. And Fish takes Amazonia. What a fun, crazy back and forth this was. Enjoyed that immensely. And that was the smallest map in the pool. That was AZ, still taking 27 minutes. Gonna get quite late. For fish tonight. Damn, I thought Blast has this. After the initial harass. Or after the tier 2 skirmishes. That looked quite convincing. But yeah, if you only go bears. At some point, MK is gonna own you. Shake has defeated Edo 2 and 0, by the way. So the first semifinal is Happy versus Shake. And Foggy is waiting for the winner of this one. Which, of course, we will all be streaming until the very, very grand final. It's, uh... It's a good chance that we get Happy versus Foggy. I felt like last week was the closest Foggy probably ever got to defeat Happy. It just looked so good. Man, how many hero kills were in this game? Did anyone count? So much hero focus. Now we go from one of the smallest maps to one of the biggest concealed hill. And there must be mountain giants, right? <laughs> kind of funny how you can lose two heroes and then still win in the mid game.
And we're ready for another human versus Night Elf. Might result in a Night Elf mirror in the semifinal, just as an undead mirror in the semifinal. These two races dominate, absolutely dominate, these ESL Cups every single week. It's been quite some time since an orc or a human were in the finals. Now, of course, especially that Foggy is back at the ESL Cups. It's been a while. He didn't uh, participate in quite some time. It seems like Monday is not his day off anymore. Both played really bad. I would say both played really fun. Tower push was the closest. For the game five, I would say yes. But the games that Foggy won, he won very convincingly. You know what I mean? Like sometimes uh, Foggy is winning, but it's super mega close and it could go either way. Last week I felt Foggy definitely had the upper hand. Game 5 was very close as well, if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, I've rarely felt the confidence in Foggy like I felt it last week. Maybe I was just super hyped and uh, remember it wrong, but... Are I felt Foggy is getting incredibly close to victory. How many millimeters is your beard? I don't know. Five to six, probably? I don't measure them. <laughs> them hairs. So, fish bottom left, blast upper right. Is he expanding again? It's definitely a keeper again, so in the beginning it's kind of the same timings. Level 3, footman chase. And if this goes really well, it's level 3, and then yeah, have fun as a human. This time, I don't know if he wants to bank on an expansion or not. Alele Blast. <laughs> I like that, I like. Claws for the Archmage, always a nice jump start. A town is under siege. And there's the fourth farm. It's an expansion. Fish expanding the pond again. Okay. Blast knows though. He detonated already, so this is the last water elemental for a long time. Not level 3 yet, but there it is. Ring plus 4. That is unfortunate. Bless is making a pit stop in the middle. Creeping the crap. Creeping the murlocs. Take some time. Wait for tier 2. Not wait for tier 2, but you know, starting tier 2. It's hard to say, like, should you expand or sh should you spend your mana already to make sure you get level 3, or do you save it until you're level 3? But that could take some more time. W I would love to see a staff by Blast, that would be amazing to just get back, get mana, do it again. Oh, denial with 150 ping, thumbs up, fish. Even getting a kill. What a mad lad. Another one! Jesus, this fish guy. Second archer down. Blast, what's up? 
defeating Sonic and then falling to fish? Probably. It's the second archer. That is an, a horrible, horrible early game for Blast. He's down a base. He lost his damage dealing units. He's not level 3. There were two denies against him. Archmage is 3. He got the staff. And he can tech in not too long. The new standard play on CH. Use your footman. Kill the Moonwills. Or even the shop. Or the wisps. Or all. Naga again. Try to go for the try hero, but hoo 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 hoo. Shop down. If you kill a couple of footmen here, totally fine. Totally fine. Keep the Night Elf away from this expo. Level 3 has been reached, so you're not accelerating your critical timing. He's even trading a bit. Not only time, but also units. The Shredder must be repaired, so that's extra resource that Blast is spending. This game is not looking good for Blast at all. Loses a... or kills a couple of footmen now. But, oh, this was a lot of resources. Players' forces are under attack. So, question now was that too many footmen dying? Tech is only at 40. Second Rex only now. This tech is a little later than I expected it to be. But on the other side, there's no lore yet. Towers up. Archmage has no mana. That's an issue. Yeah, can he just... <laughs> Wait a minute. Can the Archmage hold this? He needs militia though, right? Hold. And so it's time for the rifle production soon. Still spends a couple of resources on on footmen, which is down the road a little bit of a waste. But you know, with defend they do have value. It's not lost resources. <laughs> Love the fish emotes by the way, they're absolutely amazing. Yeah, castle attack. Still producing footmen. <laughs> Which is kind of smart. Is it smart? I don't know. Blast is rushing tier 3. So he's probably skipping all the dryads. That means rifles would lose a lot of value. He's probably rushing mountain giants. And then it's kind of smart by fish to rush tier 3 as well. Go for knights early. To a potion. Every single bit of resources that is not banked at the moment is not be going into mountain giants. And that's not good for blast. You walk once for the seven month reset. Bass is in trouble. Daytime. Prior to noon. No moon, wool, uh, moon juice anymore. Fish. What a. He's playing. I don't know. A little bit of a dirty 
form of Warcraft, I would say. It's not clean at all. It's very rough around the edges, but it's kind of working. You know what I mean? It's certainly entertaining. Wait. Okay. Thought for a second he TP's back again. He's still building footmen. We're 10 minutes 20 in a game. That's the fish I know. He's not going MGs, he's going bears. footman if he can use them to kick this expo in the butt excellent the colors are a little hard to distinguish in mirror matchups thank god this is no mirror matchup right okay is the mad lad straight up diving for the... <laughs> yep. For sure he is. And there's no nature's blessing. I really... Like, some night elves might explain this to me. What's the reason to not go nature's blessing? Isn't it great always? What a waste of an expansion this was. He's also losing creeps. That's a double level up. I can't believe my eyes. Fish... Fish and his footman. Unbelievable. He's getting the shredder. No way around it. Can only deny. <laughs> oh, Fish is just the best. Now he's replacing footman with knights. Going for a third hero. Doesn't even have a mountain king this time. Maybe that's why Blast is going bears. Because there is no MK. Silence first. What's the purpose of silence first? Maybe a misclick or something. Blast, I feel like you had a good run. Especially eliminating Sonic, but... It's not getting much better for you. Forced another TP. But that... Ooh, probably won't save the keeper I was about to say, but there was a potion. If Fish overcommits, it's definitely possible he's uh, Blast's gonna get some kills out of this. But the damage is nuts. Where's this damage coming from? Oh! Okay, Naga's still alive. Question is for how much longer. We do have Holy Light now. This spell will be coming in in a second. Nice to use Silence against uh, Priests to get a little bit of value out of these Treants because that's his kind of last hope without that Expo. TP swap. He won't lose the Paladin this time. And Blast is holding on to dear life. Respectable effort. I think he bought all the potions this world has ever seen. But he can't hold anymore. He can't hold anymore. What a performance by Fish. What a unique strategy. The 11 minute footman. <laughs> Uproots the tree. Detonates. And yeah. The 11 minute footman game. GG well played was fun, blast, mana well, mana well? Yeah, mana well, well mannered. Um, and Fish needs some luck because his opponent, as Blast says, is foggy. 
but this was certainly a wild and enjoyable matchup, don't you think? Maybe this is becoming meta now! And fish, fish games, always something else. If there's a chance to go for fish games, we certainly go for fish games. And now we go for a little bit of a break, and then we got fish versus Foggy coming up. Blast! Still thumbs up for defeating Sonic, man. That was nice. So keep it up. Sign up next week. Maybe semis are possible next week. So see you in a bit, guys. Hype.